Well guys, we're back more Ages of Shield. We're on season five, episode seventeen. It's called the Honeymoon. So guys, the last episode we left off with Colson and Talbed. They're at the mountain right now. Uh, they escaped out of the facility, out of you know General Hale's facility. Uh, Krill helped them out. He helped them to get out and escape, but he didn't make it out. He's still stuck there. Uh, we already know that he is, you know the test subject to the gravitonium and it gave him like certain memories of like the old scientist guy from that time because he's in the gravitonium i really felt bad for talbot in this one because man he was trapped in there for so long i mean like for real i mean i'm all i'm like looking forward to is seeing him get home honestly because he's just been through a lot you can definitely see by his hair it he look he's just been through a lot of hell so i mean now the team needs to be able to go get him right now cuz uh, they found out through robin cuz robin you know drew out the picture now they scanned the picture now they're going to go to those certain mountains to get them back that's pretty much what they're going to do but before this video begins guys i want to thank uh, my patreon tom for sponsoring this video uh, he's de definitely been one of my great patreon uh, supporters uh, if you guys definitely want to go support the channel i appreciate any support that comes around and on top of that i am selling these shirts this dragon ball shirt if you like this design of this Dragon Balls shirt, I'm selling it on my Shopify store. A uh, link will be down below if you're interested in buying this shirt. But anyway, guys, let's just check out this next episode. Uh oh, they're gonna jump right out. I was thinking we could come back to England for our honeymoon if we ever got one. Sounds perfect. Don't make me the third wheel, guys. <laughs> Nice. Oh, I guess she's gonna go after him. Damn, of course. No, the trail. Just start looking for shelter. Maybe get a fire going. You ever a Boy Scout? Brigadier General outranks a Boy Scout. Are you serious already? No, Talbot! Oh, get up! Come on, we gotta keep moving. Oh, just in time. Cut your powers back. It's long story, man. Get them back to the Zephyr. I'll take care of her. Not a chance. It's a rescue mission. Look at them. <sighs> Legendary Quake. You know you're. Much prettier in person. And meaner. So I would stay where you are. Oh! Oh! I don't think she's getting up from that. What are you still doing here? Oh, I thought she had you for a sec, but... Deek. Oh my god! Gotta get out of here. Let's go. Can't stop the bleeding. Grab oh, come on. Hold him still. That's not a good sign. Yeah. Talbot probably just posted these signs to keep our interlake person. They won't scare off Hydra. Let me. Where have you been? Get Simmons, we need- She's not here. She and Yo-Yo locked me in fits of cell and ran off to who knows where. Fits of cell must be the long story you mentioned. Yeah, I left you in charge. What the hell happened? Well, they think they can't be killed. You try arguing with someone who's totally irrational. He doesn't get a blood transfusion soon. No choice. Treat him here. I have zero field experience. There's no way. I'm not a surgeon. Well, just talk me through it. I'm not afraid of blood and I got a steady hand. Oh, God. Insane. Until Ivanov is providing security means we're in the right place. Yeah. Now we've lost our advantage. Look at Mac doing surgery. Some... Okay, where do we go from here? I think he has a hemothorax, blood in his chest cavity. We need to stop the bleeding and drain it. This kid's from the future. Yeah. And in that future, Earth is gone and the last of humanity is enslaved by alien overlords. <laughs> He's like, this got to be a joke. Alien over... You're telling me that we got our asses handed to us by little green men. They were big. And blue. Yep. But they didn't crack the world apart. He said it was Daisy. Oh, for the love of flapjacks. <laughs> flapjacks? Do you ever have any good news? There's a young inhuman who's seen a better future. We're working toward that. Can I talk to you for a second? You didn't even try. You just rolled over without a fight. 
I did what I thought was best, and it got results. We rescued Talbot and learned about Hale's agenda. Yeah, nearly lost Deke in the process. You should have listened to Daisy. Well, maybe Daisy shouldn't have been put in that position in the first place. You don't think she should lead? Uh-uh. She does need time. Yeah. She's questioning herself. I question myself every Let day. Let me speak. All Daisy could think about was getting you back. My time is running because out. Because you're being irresponsible. Better to go out doing something that matters. No. You don't get to make that decision alone. That decision is made with the people who love you. Me. And that's me. I love you. Oh my god. I thought that would shut you up. <laughs> yeah, he does need to make a decision now. You're not supposed to be here. I wanted you to know before her. It's all here. Yes, General, we have found the chamber. We are looking it over as we speak. Keep it secure until then. That will not be a problem, as long as you keep your word. You'll have your chance with the chamber. Another step. Oh, he wants to get in the chamber, too? Man. What was that? Nothing I can't handle. Nice. Get him away from there. Should she find it? Is this it? Or... Oh god! Why would you leave the door open? Oh! You didn't think I'd still be here. I assume Strucker opened the door. Surprised you're not with him right now. Where would we go? It kept me obedient. And I've let you control me. I have great plans for you. Like Whitehall had great plans for you? You have always said that you wanted a choice, but you've never given me one. You're my one weakness, Mom. Ruby. And I'm yours. Whoa! Ruby, stop. I'll make you proud. Oh my god. Get that ready for transport now. How'd it go? We're free and clear. I'd like to talk to my wife. You know, just to tell her I'm safe. Bill is still looking for us. We we can't have any contact with the outside world. Need him to know I haven't forgotten him. I'm sure he knows how much you love him. Yeah, he can't talk to the outside. I abandoned him, Agent Johnson. You don't get a second chance to fix a screw-up like that. That's not why you're here, is it? We're trying to figure out our next move. I need you to tell me everything you told her about us. This could take a while. Wow. Told He told her a lot. Well, that didn't take long. She won't work without this component. Time to improvise an exit strategy. You guys open one of the doors. Whoosh, whoosh, I take their guns. We shoot the robots, we go home. Mac is going to be sad to miss this. Yeah, yeah, what's going on? I was using my speed and it felt like my arms were being ripped off. Signal simultaneously. It's overloading oh. your nervous system. Damn! Oh, crap! I'm sorry you never got the honeymoon you dreamed of. Nonsense. I'm protecting England from evil robots with the man I love. Dude, Vincent Simmons looked like badasses in this, man. She needs to hurry up. There you are. Oh! Nice. Or what happened to you? Now you are also part machine. Not the part that matters. <laughs> Drugs. But hey, good news. You didn't die. Is Daisy here? She's so pretty. 
What now? I want to put my mouth on her mouth and move it around a lot, but I don't want to do that unless she wants to, too. But I don't think Look at Mag, like, what? she wants that because she does not like me one bit. No! Aw, how cute. You two have made quite the mess. <laughs> They destroyed a component for the infuser. We can't transfer the gravitonium until it's repaired. Fix it. Or bleed out. Fizz, we can't let it happen again. Don't have a choice. I'd like to know that we got a lead on Hale. You really helped. <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. I also thought about what you said about your son. It took some doing, uh, but this phone was set to bounce through a dozen foreign relays. It's call a sign. Hi, honey. It's Glenn. Oh, Glenn. I was so worried. I know. I'm, I'm so sorry. Once the Air Force took you, I, I got a few progress reports, but then you never called. Getting stronger, and I'm... <laughs> I'm not yelling. As much. The doctor said that you should take a deep breath. Calm your mind. What is best is you comply. Remember... Your compliance will be rewarded. No! Glenn, are you ready to comply? I'm happy to. No! He's controlled! Oh my freaking god. No, now Talbot is under the control of Hydra when, you know, when they say, are you ready to comply? It's like, dude, he's about to tear, he's gonna probably tear up that whole base up. I don't know. I, I don't know what he's gonna do. It's gonna be insane the next episode to see what Talbot's gonna do. Now he's like under the control of Hydra. I, I didn't know they did that to him when he was with uh, General Hale. I was never expecting that to even be, you know, him to be under that control. So they, they already knew that he was gonna call his wife or his son. They already knew that was gonna happen. And basically, you know, his wife got forced into doing that. So it's not a big surprise at all. So I'm just really wondering what's gonna freaking happen. It's gonna be insane. You no, know, Deke got shot and he had had surgery. Mac, you know, Mac and P Piper, they had to, you know, do surgery on him to save his life, man, because he was trying to keep Daisy safe because we already know he likes Daisy, you know, definitely after him admitting at the end when he was under the drugs that he likes Daisy. I mean, I never thought of Deke and Daisy being together. I'm just going to be honest, but uh, I don't think that's going to be a thing. I'm just, that's just my gut feeling. It doesn't seem like it's going to be a thing. I don't think the show's gonna let that be a thing, honestly. Deke and Daisy, I just never, I, I don't really see it happening, to be honest. I mean, I see Deke does like Daisy, but I don't think it's gonna happen. Well, Fitz and Simmons, man, look like freaking badasses in this one, man. Definitely with the scene when they're shooting the, the pretty much like the, the androids, it was just freaking awesome. This is basically like their honeymoon that they had, you know? That's what they were doing, man, just fighting everything. We saw that Yo-Yo, when she used her, her powers, her arms, were just going freaking crazy like her nerves in the arm like she was like hurting after she used her powers uh i don't they got to figure something out with that because that's going to prevent her from doing a lot of things and then we saw alex and ruby working together you know they now they're basically going to make uh fitz and simmons you know rebuild that part for the machine so ruby can get in it and become the destroyer of all worlds definitely can't wait to see the next episode guys uh, please post your comments down below tell me what you think about this awesome episode for ages of shield if you guys enjoy this reaction don't feel like in the video please don't forget to sub the channel and guys please go check out the patreon page please go support the channel i appreciate any support that comes around and also go please go check out my Sh shopify store if you guys want to get this t-shirt i do like this, this this design man it's freaking cool it says dragon ball uh definitely go check out the shopify uh, page if you want the shirt guys stay focused stay motivated see you next ages of shield